Good morning, folks. We've got eye candy, a video commentary, and some scientists who keep getting more and more out there. We have not seen any significant development in the sunspot activity, solar flaring, or Earth-directed eruptions. There is reason to keep an eye on the sun due to the sunspots beneath these bright coronal and umbral magnetic fields. The story that won't disappoint is the central coronal hole. As Earth exits the previous stream, a phi angle shift has reignited a bit of geomagnetic instability this morning. Nothing major, but it could be preconditioning the magnetosphere for the impact from the coronal hole turning through center disk. Good chance for more geomagnetic storm activity in the latter half of the week. Top geophysical event on the docket is the blood echo striking deep beneath Italy. Veteran observers' ears are ringing there. For new observers, you can learn how to use deep blot echoes and other factors to predict later surface quakes in our video called How to Predict Earthquakes, or in Chapter 7 of Weatherman's Guide to the Sun, where you'll also learn about solar forcing of seismicity, including from coronal holes like the one facing Earth today. Folks, the Polar Orbiting Satellite Fleet is getting another eye. JPSS-2 is ready to roll soon, and here we see its mapping orbit of swaths. Been waiting for this one as we currently only get a polar look once an hour with JPSS-1. Some eye candy up next at the Velus Supernova Remnant, highest detail shot ever of the double-lobed and ring features of the blast. Very gorgeous. This next one is for folks who know how absurd the black hole science can be. It's pretty bad. Here they discuss how black holes can have several different masses simultaneously. Why? Quantum physics. Poppycock. Their mathematic can't escape the absurdity of their claims where they even invoke the atrocious Schrodinger's cat experiment to explain it. Problem is, that's nonsense too. It's a discussion for another day, but alas, yes, for now they want you to believe a black hole can have several different masses at the exact same time. Lastly, folks, got a lot of people asking me to message Jimmy from Bright Insight regarding his latest video, and I'll just tell you, I don't have to. Jimmy is well aware of the disasters that plague this planet, the waves that wash over entire continents, and while I'm not sure he fully agrees with all of our aspects of the cyclical event, he is no stranger to the solar aspect, the Earth turning on its side, or the mega hits to the biosphere that come on a regular time scale. He's got eyes open just like you do, and the link to his latest video is below. We greatly appreciate your support. Watch our playlists on these topics, grab our books, book a call to chat. It's all below the video in the description box. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow, right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.